Are you ready to indulge in some serious Hollywood glamour? From plunging necklines to thigh-high slits, these red carpet looks will make you lose your shit. These dresses weren't just fashion statements. They were cultural moments that pushed the boundaries and challenged norms. So sit back and get ready to witness 50 Hollywood dresses that made people lose their minds. Number 50. Theta Bara, 1917. In 1917, the silver screen was graced with the presence of Theta Bara. She portrayed Cleopatra with such mastery that it catapulted her to the status of Hollywood's first ever femme fatale. She stunned audiences with her darling costumes, which included a bra fashioned from a coiled snake. This rebellious and risque fashion choice solidified her status as a true fashion icon. Number 49. Josephine Baker, 1920s. In the 1920s, Josephine Baker gained notoriety in Paris for her provocative Danse Sauvage performance, featuring a skirt made of artificial bananas and suggestive hip movements ahead of its time. It's safe to say that Josephine Baker was twerking long before twerking was even a term. Number 48. Jean Harlow, 1933. When one thinks of Art Deco and bias-cut gowns, it's almost impossible not to conjure up the image of Jean wearing Gilbert Adrian's costume in the film Dinner at Eight. This dress, with its low back and front crisscrossing straps, seemed to have been molded perfectly to Jean's figure. Number 47. Rita Hayworth, 1941. In 1941, Rita Hayworth posed for a captivating photo for Life magazine before earning the title of Love Goddess. The photograph, taken by Bob Landry, featured Rita in lacy silk negligee kneeling on a bed. Though deemed too scandalous for the cover, the image became the most widely distributed American pinup of all time, with over 5 million copies circulated to troops during World War II. Number 46. Marilyn Monroe, 1955. Marilyn Monroe's iconic white halter dress from the Seven Year Itch stole the show in the famous Subway Great scene, but the uproar it caused led to the scene being reshot on a set, reportedly contributing to the downfall of Marilyn's marriage to Joe DiMaggio. Number 45. Jane Mansfield, 1957. Sophia Loren was caught giving Jane Mansfield a side eye, and she later admitted to Entertainment Weekly that she was concerned about Jane's dress failing to contain her nipples. Sophia's facial expression clearly conveyed her apprehension, as she feared that Jane's outfit might have a major wardrobe malfunction. Number 44. Marilyn Monroe, 1962. Marilyn Monroe wore the original naked dress designed by Jean-Louis while singing Happy Birthday, Mr. President to John F. Kennedy. The form-fitting gown was adorned with 2,500 rhinestones. The dress made a controversial reappearance at the 2022 Met Gala when Kim Kardashian wore it amid allegations that she had damaged the iconic gown. Number 43. Carol Baker 1964. Carol Baker caused a stir at the London premiere of her 1964 film, The Carpetbaggers, by flaunting her daring see-through dress. The provocative transparent top left little to the imagination, and all eyes were on her as she strutted down the red carpet. Her bold fashion choice became the talk of the town and left fans glamouring for more. Number 42. Bianca Jagger 1971. Bianca Jagger donned a daring wedding outfit when she married Mick Jagger in 1971. Her attire included a white YSL La Smoking jacket, a long flowering skirt, and a wide-brimmed hat with a veil. Despite being four months pregnant, she wore nothing underneath the jacket. Number 41. Cher. 1974. Cher's partnership with Bob Mackey produced many iconic looks, but this feathered, naked dress was particularly buzzworthy. 
It made its debut at the Metropolitan Museum in 1974, and later graced the cover of Time magazine the next year. Number 40. Mary Tyler Moore, 1975. Mary wore a green dress with cutouts designed by her friend in an episode of The Mary Tyler Moore Show. The live audience reacted with screams and cheers. Ted Baxter was so impressed with the dress that he asked for water. Although Mary didn't like the dress, Ted thought it looked great. Number 39. Lady Diana Spencer, 1980. Before her engagement to Prince Charles, Princess Diana worked as a nursery school assistant and posed for photos at Young England Kindergarten. She made headlines when her backlit skirt accidentally revealed her legs due to the absence of a slip. Number 38. Lady Diana Spencer, 1981. Diana's fashion choice for her first public appearance with Prince Charles caused a stir. The strapless black taffeta gown, designed by Emmanuel, made her look daring and glamorous, capturing the attention of the public and making headlines. Number 37. Carrie Fisher, 1983. Carrie Fisher gained instant sex symbol status after wearing a copper bikini as Princess Leia in Return of the Jedi. However, critics, including Carrie herself, found the outfit sexist and objectifying for a heroine. In fact, she advised actress Daisy Ridley not to wear anything similar, saying, quote, You keep fighting against that slave outfit, during a conversation with Interview Magazine. Number 36. Madonna, 1984. Madonna's 1984 performance of Like a Virgin at the MTV Video Music Awards was a defining moment in pop culture history. The rising star took the stage in a daring white lace bustier top, opera-length lace gloves, and a boy toy belt that sparked controversy and cemented her status as a fashion icon. Number 35. Cher. 1988. Cher made a stunning appearance at the 1988 Academy Awards in a transparent gown designed by Bob Mackey, adorned with sequins and feathers that stole the show and has become one of the most unforgettable dresses in Oscar history. Number 34. Cindy Crawford. 1991. Cindy Crawford made her red carpet debut with Richard Gere at the Academy Awards, wearing a scarlet Versace halter dress that had a deep cut in the front and a high slit in the back. The dress was widely imitated at the time and is now regarded as one of the most legendary red carpet dresses. Number 33. Sharon Stone, 1992. Sharon Stone's character in Basic Instinct wore a sleeveless turtleneck dress made of winter white wool crepe without any underwear in one of the most iconic scenes of the movie. The all-white dress was chosen to give the character a Hitchcockian look. Sharon later disclosed that she kept the dress because she only earned $500,000, while Michael Douglas earned $14 million. Number 32. Kate Moss 1993. In 1993, 19-year-old Kate Moss turned heads at an elite models party in London with her daring choice of attire, a silver slip dress by Liza Bruce that was so sheer it left little to the imagination. The dress quickly became one of Kate's most iconic looks and had people talking about it for years to come. Number 31. Elizabeth Hurley, 1994. Elizabeth Hurley, an unknown figure at the time, wore a Versace dress with safety pins to the premiere of Four Weddings and a Funeral in London with her then-boyfriend, Hugh Grant. The dress catapulted her to global fame virtually overnight. Number 30. Princess Diana, 1994. On the same day that Prince Charles admitted to cheating on Princess Diana on national TV, she wore a form-fitting, off-the-shoulder mini-dress designed by Christina Stambolian with a sweetheart neckline. The dress, now called the Revenge Dress, was seen as her way of getting back at her ex. Number 29. Lizzie Gardner, 
1995. This dress was made by Oscar-winning costume designer Lizzie Gardner using 254 expired American Express gold cards. Although it was intended for the film Priscilla, Queen of the Desert, it was never used on screen because American Express didn't give its approval. Number 28. Britney Spears, 1999. Britney Spears had a significant role in the creation of the music video for her first single, Baby One More Time. The director, Nigel Dick, revealed that during the wardrobe fitting, Britney initially suggested wearing jeans and t-shirts. But later, she came up with the idea of a schoolgirl outfit, which became the iconic look of the video. Number 27. Rose McGowan, 1998. Rose McGowan turned heads at the 1998 MTV VMAs by wearing a beaded dress that left little to the imagination. She admitted to Roseanne Barr that her intention was to make a statement and attract attention, and the dress certainly achieved that. Number 26. Lil' Kim, 1999. Miley Cyrus paid homage to Lil' Kim's iconic VMAs look by dressing up as her for Halloween in 2013. Lil' Kim approved of the costume, saying that the purple pasty and hair were loved by people all over the world, and receiving compliments on Halloween was a big deal. Number 25. Jennifer Lopez, 2000. Back in 2000, Jennifer Lopez turned heads at the Grammy Awards in a green silk chiffon dress by Versace that had been worn before by other celebrities. However, J.Lo put her own spin on it, and the dress was so revealing that it dipped below her belly button. The public was obsessed with seeing the dress, and it's even credited with inspiring the creation of Google Image Search as people desperately searched for images of J.Lo in the iconic dress. Number 24. Bjork, 2001. Bjork's dress, created by Marjan Pajoski, was made up of a swan wrapped around her neck with its beak resting on her chest, and a tulle skirt. She even carried ostrich eggs while walking down the red carpet. The dress is now part of a retrospective on her career at the Museum of Modern Art in New York. Number 23. Tony Braxton, 2001. Tony Braxton wore a Richard Tyler dress with two panels, one on the front and one on the back, held together by a belt that left a wide gap in between. In an interview with People in 2014, Tony shared that the dress made her look more youthful and toned. She also mentioned that people were curious about what she was wearing underneath it. Number 22. Christina Aguilera, 2002. At the 2002 MTV VMAs, Christina Aguilera made a fashion statement that landed her on many worst dressed lists. She paired a denim miniskirt with a scarf as halter top that left little to the imagination. In her signature dirty style, she rocked black and blonde hair and heavy eye makeup. Number 21. Gwyneth Paltrow, 2002. Gwyneth Paltrow had some regrets about her look for the 2002 Academy Awards. Even though she loved the dress, she admitted to some problems with it. She wrote on Goop, quote, There were a few issues. I still love the dress itself, but I should have worn a bra, and I should have had simply beachy hair and less makeup. Then it would have worked as I wanted it to. A little bit of punk at the Oscars. Number 20. Kate Middleton, 2002. This is the dress that reportedly made Prince William fall for Kate Middleton. She wore it during a charity fashion show at St. Andrews, where she was a student. The see-through dress was designed by Charlotte Todd, and it was the first time the prince saw her on the runway that made his heart skip a beat. Number 19. Laura Flynn Boyle, 2003. At the Golden Globes, Laura Flynn Boyle stole the show with her unique fashion statement. As a newly single woman after a breakup with Jack Nicholson, she opted for an ill-fitting ballerina dress made by designer David Cardona. 
The top was crafted from suede, while the skirt was made of silk tulle, creating a look that was both edgy and ethereal. Number 18. Michelle Obama, 2009 Michelle Obama's first official portrait as a first lady may have seemed basic, with a classic black sheath and double-stranded pearl necklace, but the Michael Kors dress stirred up controversy. Michelle's sculpted arms, which were visible because of the sleeveless design, were the talk of the town. While some criticized her for bearing her arms, others praised her for being a fit and healthy role model. Number 17. Lady Gaga, 2010. Lady Gaga made a memorable appearance at the VMAs when she wore a meat dress designed by Frank Fernandez. The outfit was completed with meat shoes, a meat hat, and a meat purse, making it a truly unique ensemble. The meat dress was so iconic that it was later put on display at the prestigious Rock and Roll Hall of Fame. Number 16. Venus Williams, 2010. Venus Williams caused quite a stir at the French Open with her daring fashion choice, a black lace tennis dress she designed herself. The dress was paired with flesh-colored boy shorts that caused even more controversy. But Venus had a purpose in mind. According to her, the illusion of bare skin was more beautiful, and that was the intended effect. Number 15. Pippa Middleton, 2011 As a bridesmaid, Pippa Middleton assisted her sister Kate in managing her nearly nine-foot-long bridal train all while wearing a stunning dress designed by Sarah Burton of Alexander McQueen. Pippa's dress was so impressive that it almost overshadowed the bride herself. Number 14. Angelina Jolie, 2012 In 2012, it was not just the black Atalia Versace gown that made headlines, but the actress's determined pose that truly stole the show. She pushed her right leg out through the dress's high slit, creating a viral image that left the public in awe. Number 13. Gwyneth Paltrow, 2013. Gwyneth Paltrow's sheer Antonio Berardi gown was more than just a dress. During her appearance on The Ellen DeGeneres Show, Gwyneth revealed that she couldn't wear underwear with it and had to go hairless. Quote, well, let's just say everyone went scrambling for a razor. I work a 70s vibe, you know what I mean? Gwyneth said. The gown's sheer side panels that exposed a lot of leg had already grabbed attention, but this made it even more interesting. Number 12. Jamie Alexander, 2013. The actress attended the premiere of Thor, The Dark World in 2013, wearing a dress that relied heavily on toupee tape to keep her from going completely naked. Without the tape, it would have been a major fashion disaster. She revealed the fashion secret while chatting with Jay Leno. Number 11. Amber Rose, 2014 Amber Rose's outfit at the 2014 VMAs was nothing short of eye-catching. The chain metal dress designed by Laurel DeWitt left little to the imagination and reminded many of Rose McGowan's iconic outfit from the 1998 VMAs. Despite the similarities, the dress still managed to stun people. According to DeWitt, the goal was to create unique, exclusive pieces that would attract stylists to her designs. Number 10. Rihanna, 2014 When Rihanna received the CFDA Fashion Icon Award in 2014, she made sure all eyes were on her with a dazzling mesh dress created by Adam Selman. According to the designer, they dyed the mesh to match Rihanna's skin tone and adorned it with over 230,000 plain and colored crystals that left little to the imagination. It was a daring and impressive look that cemented Rihanna's status as a true fashion icon. Number 9. Miley Cyrus, 2015 Miley Cyrus made a bold fashion statement in 2015 by wearing a unique Versace dress that was half-harnessed. 
The daring outfit featured intricate leather straps that crisscrossed around her chest and waist, creating a striking look that stunned onlookers. The pop star's outfit choice demonstrated her fearless attitude and willingness to push boundaries on the red carpet. Number 8. Beyoncé, 2015 The Met Gala buzzed with gossip after the infamous elevator incident involving Beyoncé in 2014. However, the pop icon returned with a bang in 2015, accompanied by Jay-Z, and left everyone talking about her stunning sheer Givenchy gown designed by Ricardo Tisci, adorned with dazzling embellishments. Number 7. Rita Ora 2015 Rita Ora commanded attention at the 2015 Billboard Music Awards with a jaw-dropping dress that left little to the imagination. The metallic gold stars on the dress were dazzling, but the real showstoppers were the daring cutouts that showcased her toned physique in a bold and provocative way. Number 6. Bella Hadid 2016 Bella Hadid made a daring fashion statement at Cannes with her custom gown by Alexander Fautier Couture, which appeared nearly sheer and left little to the imagination. Despite the possibility of exposure, the dress had a built-in silk bodysuit and was secured in place with top-stick tape, according to the model's stylist. Number 5. Kendall Jenner, 2018 this particular outfit worn by the model was especially unforgettable because of its bold and risque nature. The stunning green number left little to the imagination, and it was no coincidence that the model shared a snapshot of herself in it on Instagram with a playful oops as the caption. Number 4. Emily Ratajkowski, 2019 the model's Met Gala appearance in 2019 was a tribute to the legendary Cher, whom she crowned as the, quote, Queen of Camp with a sultry twist. The enormous cutout was a bold choice, as the slightest movement could have resulted in a fashion faux pas. Fortunately, her expert team was on hand to ensure that everything went according to plan. Number 3. Gigi Hadid, 2020 Gigi Hadid never fails to look stunning, but her runway appearance in 2020 was particularly jaw-dropping. The dress, worn during the Jacques Mousse show at Paris Fashion Week, featured a daringly high slit and delicate straps that showed off her flawless figure. Number 2. Zendaya 2021 Zendaya stole the show at the Spider-Man No Way Home premiere with her jaw-dropping custom Valentino Haute Couture gown. The spider-themed dress had a bold neckline and an ultra-high slit, leaving little to the imagination and making heads turn. Number 1. Florence Pugh, 2022 the 2022 Venice Film Festival was full of juicy gossip, and the actress in her daring Valentino gown was just the beginning. The real shocker was the appearance of Florence, Olivia Wilde, and Harry Styles together on the red carpet, which had everyone buzzing and speculating about what was really going on between them. And there you have it, folks. 50 Hollywood dresses that left us all in awe, shock, and sometimes even controversy. From the iconic red carpet moments that broke the internet, to the jaw-dropping outfits that we'll never forget, these Hollywood dresses definitely made people lose their shit. All right, that's it for today. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video.